Okay, this is the Fez, Steely Dan, off the Royal Scam album. Uh, if you'd like to support the work I'm doing, there's a link to my subscribe star in the description. There's also a link to a chord chart and chord diagrams. All right, I'm just going to play the intro, and uh, I'm going to just play through some of the tune and just uh, so you can get an idea of how it goes. It's not a real long song. It kind of repeats a lot of stuff, so three, four... <laughs> Okay, so that's that's a verse chorus okay so we're just going to start at the intro so the first uh, the intro chords are starts on C sharp seven and basically these are the this is the chord that's the five the three the flat seven and the one I'm only playing three of these notes so the three the flat seven and the one because this is what's going on Okay, then you're going to go to F sharp seven, and we're going to play three notes here too. There's the flat seven, the three, and the one. Okay, so here we go. Then move that, and then we're going to move this C sharp seven down to B seven. Do the same thing, and then E seven. So it's the same pattern. By the way, I have D7 written on the chart and G flat seven. So D flat seven, G flat seven, and then B7 to E7. Okay, then the, okay, so the verse starts out on A minor seven. So, you can play it like this, so just bar all the way across here, and then on this, the A string right here, okay? So what you have here is, uh, you could play it like this. That's the five, the flat three, the flat seven, and of course you want the one in there, so you can just bar these three, these three, and like this, or bar across here, and play it like that. Then it goes to F major seven, so we got the seven, the five, the three, and the one. And then we're going to B half diminished. And you know, um, I was listening to the keyboard part, so he's kind of doing something like, to, uh, you know. This all works. Okay, so this is a, there's the uh, the flat five, flat three, flat seven, and the one. So this is a B half diminished. Okay, and then you could just move this note down. Okay, that's like the four or the 11. And then it goes to E7 sharp nine. So we got the sharp nine there, the flat seven, three, and one. So, and I'm putting the low E in the bass here. And then you could drop this down to the flat nine. So you're gonna, so basically the, the basic chord is E7 right here. And then you have the sharp nine here and the flat nine here. So in order to get this, I'm, I'm barring this index finger to get the flat nine. Okay, so these are the these are the four chords. But you don't have to do all this movement. You can just go. And 
I'm, I'm playing that. Or you could play... Because they all work over this, so uh, just trying to give you some options, okay? All right, now, when it goes to the chorus, that's what I am, please understand, I want to be your holy man. Okay, that section there, I'm going to give you some easier chords to play, but then I'm going to show you what I play. So, uh, okay, so... Okay, so we're going to play F7, so, and then D7, and then C sharp 7. So these three chords. And I really, I stick with these three notes. Okay, and then C major 7. So, let's make sure we get these, okay? This is the flat 7, the 3, and the 1. That's F7. Then we're going to move this whole thing down to D7, and then to C sharp 7, same same pattern. Then we're going to go to C major 7, that's the uh, 3, the 7, the 5, and the 1. And then B flat major 7, just move this whole thing down a whole step. Okay then, so we're playing A flat major 7. And then C sharp major seven. So here's the uh, A flat major seven. That's the five, the three, the seven, and the one. And then we're going to C sharp major seven. There's the three, the seven, the five, and the one. And then we're gonna do uh, G flat major seven. Five, three, seven, one. So it's. Actually, no, uh, this is, instead of this, it's actually a sixth chord. Okay, so then we're going uh, C major 7. And then A flat major 7 to C sharp major 7 or D flat major 7. And then it's uh, G flat 6 or F sharp 6. So here's the 6, the 3 the five and the one. So you can play it like this, or you could add the, another one here. I like this one better because you've got you've got a different note uh, handling everything. So you got the one, the five, three, and six. Okay, now the way that I'm playing it, instead of playing this F7, I'm playing a like an F13 down here. Only I'm playing it, I'm fingering it like this. So here's the 13, the three, and the flat seven, and then I'm grabbing the uh, the one with my thumb. So it's uh, that's what I am. Okay, and then I'm going to D nine. So I'm I'm actually playing this D seven like I showed you before. I'm just adding the nine, and then sliding that down. Okay to uh, C sharp nine. And then I'm playing, just because I like this chord, it's adding a ninth to it. So here's the three, the nine, the seven, and the one. So it's the same as, as C major seven. I like, this is a little more of a airy sound to it, you know? And then B flat, just move that whole thing down. And then I'm doing my thumb chord. So there's the, uh, the five, that's the nine, one, five, one. Okay, instead of playing A major seven, but you can, you know, because I'm grabbing this top note too, that's the major seven up here. And then I'm playing that just uh, the way that I showed you earlier. That's uh, C sharp major seven or D flat major seven. And then. G flat six, okay? That's what I am. Okay, now we're gonna get into the guitar solo. 
Okay, let me just play um, a little bit of the verse and then the chorus and then I'll get into the guitar solo. Three, four. <laughs> So when we get uh, at the end of the, the, the second chorus, then it goes into the guitar solo. So we're going to do this. Uh, this one I please understand. I want to be your Okay, you know all this. Okay, now, so this part here. Okay, so this is B flat six. There's a six, the three, the five, and the one. I'm kind of muting, I'm letting this mute some of these strings that I'm not playing. Because I'm not playing the D string, right? And I don't want to ring it, so I'm just kind of letting this mute. Okay, now we're going to go to A7. So we're just going to move this, we're going to move three of these fingers down. These three, we're going to move them down a half step. And that's going to be A7. So here's the, the flat seven, the three, the five, and the one. See, in the B flat six, we have... Six, three, five, one. We move these down, and we got flat seven, three, five, one. And then we're going up to D minor seven. Okay. So this is D minor seven. So here's the five, the flat three, the flat seven, and the one. And then we're gonna play C sixth. So there's the six. Three, five, or some just same as voicing as it was before. And then and then B7. So, so there's a lot of repeat of these chords. Okay? So uh, and then the the solo is uh, C major seven. There's the three, the seven, five, one. And then E minor. Or E minor seven. You can play it up here, so so you can blow. Back to C major seven, or you can play. Here's C major seven here. There's a five, three, seven, one, and then E minor seven. So these are the notes, and then we want this E here, and then and then the low E. I'm just gonna let that ring. See, this is an easy move here. And then now we're going to do the same kind of lick here. F6, the 6, 3, 5, 1. And then we're going to do E7. So we're doing the same move. We're moving these, these three notes down a half step. So it's going to look like this. So we got the flat 7, the 3, the 5, and the open. And you can let these all ring. Let them all ring if you want. Okay, then we're going A minor seven. So it's it's just like the beginning of the the uh, solo. So it's, it's, we're just moving this whole thing down here. So A minor seven, then G six. And then G flat seven. Okay? And then this walk down, the chords while there's the it's finishing up the guitar solo, we're gonna play. This is what we're playing. This is like an A triad at the very top with a with a B in the bass. So it'd be kind of like this chord. But it's the, the voicing is up here. So you got an A triad. So just bar, and we want that note too, so we're going to bar and play this. Move that whole thing down to G over F, no, G over A, so it'd be like this. 
So, now we're gonna play a G major seven. Actually, has, there's a ninth in there too. So here's the nine, the major seven, the five, and the one. Move that down to F major nine, same, same voicing. And then, so. Okay, so that's, that's like a, that'd be like a, uh, a E7. So you got the, there's the, uh, that's, well, that's the ninth, the flat seven, the five, and the one. Okay, so. And then A minor, add nine. Okay, there's the flat third, here's the ninth, there's the five, and here's the, the one, and you can let them all ring. From the A string, let them all ring. So. And then it does this part of the intro. B7, and then E7, and then, then it goes back to this. So it does a uh, it does uh, another verse and the chorus and then it just vamps out on this. So that's that's the whole tune. So let, let me just do the the uh, the solo one more time. So uh, starting from here. Okay, that's the whole tune. I hope you got something out of that. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.